This is lecture number 15. How to perform results recording for quality inspection lot. Trainer, Mohammed Akib Sheikh. This is lecture number 15. We will learn in this lecture that how to perform inspection results recording for materials lot or batch. Write transaction code QA32 in command bar and press enter icon. A new window will be appeared. Inspection lot selection. Under the heading inspection lot selection, we enter plant inspection lot origin material number and batch number. You can search the materials lot by setting up your own criteria according to your requirement. Enter plant. Enter inspection type. Enter material number. Enter batch number, if needed. Under the list setting, we will choose second option, select only inspection lots without a usage decision. This is because that we are going to perform results recording and other QM activities on pending lot or lot without a usage decision. After completion, entries of mandatory fields, press enter key from your keyboard. Then press execute button or press shortcut key F8 from your keyboard. A new window will be displayed, change data for inspection lot work list for inspection lot. You can see here different buttons such as usage decision, defects, results and inspection lot etc. You can perform these quality management activities as per your requirement. We will perform results recording first and then we will learn other activities in next lectures step by step. Here you can see the materials inspection lot. We will select this materials lot and click on results button to proceed further. A new window will be appeared, record results, characteristic overview. You can see here inspection characteristics, which we have assigned in inspection plan. In lecture number 10 we have learned how to create an inspection plan. There are five inspection characteristics are displaying here for this inspection plan and we will enter inspection results for each inspection characteristic. We will choose physical appearance characteristic, then click in result field like this. Then click on list icon, a pop-up window will be appeared, catalog selection, characteristic attributes, codes and code group are displaying here. In previous lectures, we have learnt about how to create characteristic attributes, selected sets, codes and code group etc. Here you can see selected set or specification of this test, that is, as per standard specimen. If text is longer than 40 characters, you can read full description by pressing display long text button. Like this. Now on the basis of this selected set or specification, we will comply or not comply the result. If this test meets our specification then we will choose complies by selecting this and press continue button or double click on this description. Then press enter button from your keyboard. When you press enter button, Notice that sample size quantity is appeared here and entry of first test is done. Now we will enter results for color test. For this, follow the above steps. Now we will enter inspection results for numeric or quantitative inspection characteristic. At the time of creation inspection plan, we have chosen single results recording parameter so you can see plus sign is enabled, it means that you can enter multiple results values for this inspection characteristic according to your inspection results. 
after entry of first value, plus sign button expand automatically, you will enter more result values as you defined. Like this. You notice here that the values are meets the inspection criteria or according to lower or upper limits, the system evaluate these results values as right or wrong by displaying the right or cross symbols. We have entered five results values for this characteristic and the system calculate average value automatically. Here you can see it. Now press minus sign button to close the results values section. Now we will perform results recording for width. Repeat all the steps as we have done for length test. Enter 5 multiple results values according to inspection. You notice that plus sign of height inspection characteristic is disable. This is because we have set the criteria in control indicators as summarized recording. That's why we can enter one value or average value for this test. Like this. Then press enter from your keyboard. After completion of entries for all inspection results, we will select all inspection characteristic. Now we will click on evaluate button so that the system can evaluate the inspection results. Here you can see that the system has evaluate the results successfully. A message appeared that the evaluation was successful. Then we will press close button to close the results. Like this. A message appeared that successfully closed. Now you will click on save button to save the transaction. Great work. You have done it. This is the end of lecture number 15. In lecture number 16, we will learn how to change inspection results for quality inspection lot or batch.